Lord our God, I come before you once more to offer to you my prayers. I have made my pleas to you again and again, and each moment I do, the more my faith increases that you are truly the God of life and of love. However, there have been a number of times also that I failed to call on you, that I failed to love my neighbors, that I failed to keep my promises, that I failed to ask for pardon and to give pardon to others, that I failed to give thanks for all the blessings that come my way. And yet in all these moments, you are ever present, O Lord, to remind me that you are just around to take me back once more, if I will but come to you. By meditating on the mysteries of the Holy Rosary, especially in this novena in honor of the Queen of the Holy Rosary of Manawag, may I be led to find your presence in my life as Mother Mary found it in her own life. In every mystery of my joy, in every mystery of my sorrow, in every mystery of my glory, may I be able to recognize your hand that I may know you are indeed the Emmanuel the God who is with us now and forever. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Lord, open my lips, and my mouth shall declare your praise. God, come to my assistance. O Lord, make haste to help me. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. The five joyful mysteries, the first mystery, the Annunciation. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. Please stand.
The second joyful mystery, the visitation. Our Father who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Glory, Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. Please stand. joyful mystery, the birth of our Lord. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. 
Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. Please stand. joyful mystery, the presentation of the Lord at the temple. Our Father who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, 
Pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Glory, Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. Please stand. joyful mystery, the finding of the child Jesus at the temple. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. Litany in honor of the Blessed Virgin Mary, 
Lord, have mercy on us. Lord, have mercy on us. Christ, have mercy on us. Christ, have mercy on us. Lord, have mercy on us. Lord, have mercy on us. Christ, hear us. Christ, graciously hear us. Get the Father in heaven. Have mercy on us. Get the Son, Redeemer of the world. Have mercy on us. Get the Holy Spirit. Have mercy on us. Holy Trinity, one God. Have mercy on us. Holy Mary, pray for us. Holy Mother of God, pray for us. Holy Virgin of Virgins, pray for us. Mother of Christ, pray for us. Mother of the Church, pray for us. Mother of Mercy, pray for us. Mother of Divine Grace, pray for us. Mother of Hope, pray for us. Mother Most Pure, pray for us. Mother Most Chaste, pray for us. Mother Inviolate, pray for us. Mother and Defile, pray for us. Mother Most Amiable, pray for us. Mother Most Admirable, pray for us. Mother of Good Counsel, pray for us. Mother of our Creator, pray for us. Mother of our Savior, pray for us. Virgin Most Prudent, pray for us. Virgin Most Venerable, pray for us. Virgin Most Renowned, pray for us. Virgin Most Powerful, pray for us. Virgin Most Merciful, pray for us. Virgin Most Faithful, pray for us. Mirror of Justice, pray for us. Seat of Wisdom, pray for us. Cause of our joy, pray for us. The spiritual vessel, pray for us. Vessel of honor, pray for us. Singular vessel of devotion, pray for us. Mystical rose, pray for us. Tower of David, pray for us. Tower of ivory, pray for us. House of gold, pray for us. Ark of the covenant, pray for us. Gate of heaven, pray for us. Morning star, pray for us. Health of the sick, pray for us. Refuge of sinner, pray for us. Solace of migrants, pray for us. Comforter of the afflicted, pray for us. Help of Christians, pray for us. Queen of angels, pray for us. Queen of patriarchs, pray for us. Queen of prophets, pray for us. Queen of apostles, pray for us. Queen of martyrs, pray for us. Queen of confessors, pray for us. Queen of virgins, pray for us. Queen of all saints, pray for us. Queen conceived without original sin, pray for us. Queen assumed into heaven, pray for us. Queen of the Holy Rosary, pray for us. Queen of Peace, pray for us. Queen of the Family, pray for us. Lamb of God, you take away the sins of the world. Spare us, O Lord. Lamb of God, you take away the sins of the world. Graciously hear us, O Lord. Lamb of God, you take away the sins of the world. Have mercy on us. Queen of the Holy Rosary of Manawa, Pray for us that we may be made worthy of the promises of Christ. Let us pray. O God, whose only begotten Son, by his life, death, and resurrection, has purchased for us the rewards of eternal life, grant we beseech you that through the meditating upon these mysteries of the Holy Rosary of the Blessed Virgin Mary, we may imitate what they contain and obtain what they promise through Christ our Lord. Extend, O Lord, to your servants your heavenly aid, that we may seek you with all our hearts and obtain what we ask. Hear, O Lord, our prayers and grant to our deceased associates the rest of heaven and to your church peace. Through the intercession of the glorious Virgin Mary and the merits of your Son, our Lord Jesus Christ. Amen. Prayer to Saint Joseph. Behold the faithful and prudent steward whom the Lord has set over his household. The Lord has shown him his love and covered him with glory. He has clothed him in splendid garment. Let us pray. Almighty God, at the beginning of our salvation, when Mary conceived your son and brought him forth into the world, you placed him under Joseph's watchful care May his prayers still help your church to be an equally faithful guardian of your mysteries and a sign of Christ to mankind. We make our prayers through Christ our Lord. Amen.
my Lord Jesus Christ. True God and true man, my Father and Redeemer, I kneel in the presence of your divine majesty, overcome with grief for having offended you, my God, so deserving of all my love. I believe in you, I trust you, and trusting in your infinite mercy, I hope to have my sins forgiven. With the help of your divine grace, I resolve to confess my sins and to start my life anew. Chastise me in this life, O Lord, but spare me in eternity. Help me make my life a worthy oblation to atone for all my sins and the sins of all men. During this novena to Mary, your mother, Queen of the Most Holy Rosary, help me to know you better, to love you more fervently, to serve you with more dedication. Grant me the grace to live and persevere in your service until death. Amen. Prayer for every day of the Novena. O most clement virgin, O tenderest mother, O sweetest Mary, comforter of the afflicted and refuge of sinners, mediatrix between God and men. You are Noah's art, our salvation in the deluge of sin. You are the rainbow of peace, our reconciliation with God. You are the dove that brings us the olive branch of peace. As a token of your maternal love, you gave to the Catholic world, through your son Dominic, the most holy rosary. Through this devotion, pagans were converted, heretics brought back to the true fault, enemies of the church vanquished, and Christian society reformed. Queen of the Most Holy Rosary, we call on you for assistance. You alone did overcome all heresies in the world. Deliver now your Christian people from the snares of the devil. Great was your love for this nation, for when the enemies of the Catholic religion threatened to take away our faith, you saved us miraculously through your intercession, and thus secured for yourself the title of Queen and Mother of the Philippines. Look down with mercy on those who are deceived by the evil one, that they may renounce their heresy and return to the unity of the Catholic truth. Will you mean our rulers that under your guidance they may govern this land as worthy representatives of God? Inspire us all to study our religion, to fulfill the commandments, and to receive the sacraments which are the essentials of true Christian life. As we became Christians through your intercession, we also hope to live as such under your protection. With your rosary as our anchor, we hope to reach that heavenly kingdom where for all eternity we can have you as our Queen and Christ our King. Amen. Special prayer for the eighth day. Queen of the Most Holy Rosary, Mother of the Philippines. I behold you supported by the apostles when the Holy Spirit came into the form of tongues of fire at the first Pentecost. Being the mother of Jesus, you were also the mother of the apostles, the mother of the Catholic Church. What a transformation in the apostles. Pray that I too may be transformed from a nominal Catholic to a real one, from an indifferent Catholic to a fervent one, and from a dormant Catholic to a missionary one. Obtain for me from the Holy Spirit the courage and strength to spread and defend my faith. May I never be an occasion of sin to others, but a source of inspiration in their struggle to be good. Through the Holy Spirit, whom I receive fully at confirmation, may I believing image of your Son, Jesus, and thus serve as a fitting model for the interior transformation of my neighbors. Let us now ask a particular favor we wish to obtain in this novena through the intercession of Our Lady of the Rosary of Manawa. Hail Mary, fully grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. 
Hail Mary, fully grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, fully grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Final prayer for every day. Queen of the Most Holy Rosary. Refuge of the human race, we humbly prostrate ourselves before your throne, confident that we shall receive mercy, grace, assistance, and protection, not through our own inadequate merits, but solely through the great goodness of your maternal heart. May the sight of the widespread material and moral destruction, the offerings and sorrows of countless human beings, move you to compassion. O Mother of mercy, obtain peace for us from God and procure for us those graces which prepare, establish, and assure that peace. Queen of Peace, pray for us and give to the world and to the Philippines the peace for which we are all longing, the peace in the truth, justice, and charity of Christ. Lastly, O Queen of Heaven, as the Church and the entire human race are consecrated to the Sacred Heart of Jesus, so that in reposing all hope in Him, He might become for them the pledge of victory and salvation. So we, in like manner, consecrate ourselves to You, Queen of the Most Holy Rosary, You who have chosen to raise Your throne of mercy in Manawa, to be in the beloved protectress and patroness of the province of Pangasinan, and from there to bestow your graces on us, your children, banish in this valley of tears. Look down with your eyes, mercy upon us, who are beset with so many dangers of body and soul. Despise not our petition, O dearest mother, but intercede for us before your divine Son, now one at the hour for death. Amen. Amen. Please stand. the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen.
brothers and sisters, we are gathered in the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. The grace of our Lord Jesus Christ, and the love of God, and the communion of the Holy Spirit be with you all. And with your spirit. Magandang umaga po mga kapatid sa inyong lahat, at welcome po sa Basilica Minore ng Our Lady of the Rosary of Manawag. Tayo po ay narinito para dalhin sa mahal na ina ang ating pasasalamat at ang ating mga pagsusubamo sa Diyos na sa tulong ng mahal na ina, tayo ay kalingain at pakinggan sa ating mga pagsusumamo. Kaya mga kapatid, let us now acknowledge our sins and so prepare ourselves to celebrate the sacred mysteries. I confess to Almighty God, and to, and you, to you, my, my brothers, brothers and sisters, sisters that, that I have greatly sinned, sinned in my thoughts and in my words, in what I have done and in what I have failed to do, through my fault, through my fault, through my most grievous fault. Therefore I ask, Blessed Mary, ever Virgin, all the angels and saints, and you, my brothers and sisters, to pray for me to the Lord our God. May Almighty God have mercy on us, forgive us our sins, and bring us to everlasting life. Amen. in excelsis Deo. Let us pray. Lord our God, Savior of the human family, you brought salvation and joy to the home of Elizabeth through the visit of the Blessed Virgin Mary, the Ark of the New Covenant. We ask that, in obedience to the inspiration of the Holy Spirit, we too may bring Christ to others and proclaim your greatness by the praise of our lips and the holiness of our lives. Through our Lord Jesus Christ, your Son, who lives and reigns with you in the unity of the Holy Spirit, one God, forever and ever. Amen. Please be seated. A reading from the book of the prophet Zephaniah. Shout for joy, O daughter Zion. Sing joyfully, O Israel. Be glad and exult with all your heart, O daughter Jerusalem. The Lord has removed the judgment against you and turned away your enemies. The King of Israel, the Lord, is in your midst. You have no further misfortune to fear. On that day, it shall be said to Jerusalem, Fear not, O Zion, be not discouraged. The Lord your God is in your midst, a mighty Savior. The Lord will rejoice over you with gladness and renew you in His love. The Lord will sing joyfully because of you as one sings at festivals. The word of the Lord. Thanks be to God. Among you is the great and holy one of Israel. Among you is the great and holy one of Israel. God indeed is my savior. I am confident and unafraid. My strength and my courage is the Lord, and he has been my savior. With joy you will draw water at the fountain of salvation. 
Among you is the great and holy one of Israel. Give thanks to the Lord, acclaim his name. Among the nations make known his deeds, proclaim how exalted is his name. Among you is the great and holy one of Israel. Sing praise to the Lord for his glorious achievement. Let his be known throughout all the earth. Shout with exultation, O city of Zion, for great is in your midst, is the Holy One of Israel. Among you is the great and Holy One of Israel. Please stand. Blessed are you, O Virgin Mary, for firmly believing that the promises of the Lord would be fulfilled. The Lord be with you and with your spirit. A reading from the Holy Gospel according to Luke. Glory to you, O Lord. Mary set out and traveled to the hill country in haste to a town of Judah where she entered the house of Zechariah and greeted Elizabeth. When Elizabeth heard Mary's greeting, the infant leapt in her womb, and Elizabeth, filled with the Holy Spirit, cried out in a loud voice and said, Most blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb. And how does this happen to me, that the mother of my Lord should come to me? For the, at the moment the sound of your greeting reached my ears, the infant in my womb leapt for joy. Blessed are you who believed that what was spoken to you by the Lord would be fulfilled. And Mary said, My soul proclaims the greatness of the Lord. My spirit rejoices in God my Savior. For the Lord has looked upon his handmaid's lowliness. Behold, from now on will all generations call me blessed. The Mighty One has done great things for me, and holy is His name. The Lord's mercy is from age to age to those who fear Him. The Lord has shown His might, might with His arm, dispersed the arrogant of mind and heart. The Lord has thrown down the rulers from their thrones, but lifted up the lowly. The hungry is filled with good things. The rich is sent away empty. The Lord has helped Israel, his servant, remembering his mercy, according to his promise to our ancestors, to Abraham and his, to, to his descendants forever. Mary remained with Elizabeth about three months and then returned to her home. My brothers and sisters, the Gospel of the Lord. Praise to you, Lord Jesus Christ. Please be seated. Mga kapatid, maraming dahilan kung bakit tayo ay nagpupunta, bumibisita, nananalangin dito po sa dambana ng mahal ng ina ng manawag. Kadasa, kadalasan, tayo ay pilit na pumupunta dito kahit na ano pang layo nito, kahit na ano pang init dito sa lawigan na ito, sapagkat may mga panalangin, meron tayong mga kahilingan na ating i-request sa mahal na ina ng Diyos upang kanyang dalhin papalapit kay Kristo ating Panginoon. Yan ang kada kadalasang dahilan. Tayo ay naririto para kumatok, para humingi, para maghanap ng direksyon sa buhay kasama natin si Maria na aakayin tayo palapit kay Kristo. Subalit, hindi lamang yan ang dahilan. 
marami din sa atin dito ay naririto hindi para humingi, kundi para magpasalamat sa Diyos, para ipahayag sa ating mga kapatid, kaibigan, ang kadakilaan at ang pag-ibig ng Diyos sa ating lahat. Sana po bawat isa sa atin naririto hindi lamang para humingi, kundi para magpasalamat sa pagkatay na puspos ng biyaya ng Diyos. Na puspos ng biyaya ng Diyos. Ang bawat isa sa atin, palaging may tiyak na biyaya sa Diyos. Hindi tayo pwedeng pumunta dito sa manawag kung hindi tayo binihayaan ng Diyos. Sa pagising pa lang natin sa umaga, biyaya na ng Diyos. Yung ating kabuhayan, yung ating pamilyang buo, tayo na malusog, nakakatayo, nakakapagtrabaho, nakakapag-aral, biyaya ng Diyos. Wala ni isa dito ang hindi tumatanggap ng biyaya ng Diyos. Kaya nga, may dahilan para ngumiti. May dahilan para magpahayag ng dakilang pangalan ng Diyos. May dahilan para magpasalamat. Alam ninyo, si Maria, bago siya nagpunta at bumisita sa kanyang pinsang si Elizabeth, ay napuspos ng biyaya ng Diyos. Punong-puno ang kanyang pagkatao, ang kanyang kaluluwa ng kadakilaan ng Diyos sapagkat tinanggap niya sa kanyang sinapupunan ang tagapagligtas ng sangkatauhan. Pinakadakila, pinakaperpektong biyaya na natanggap ng tao sa katauhan ni Maria. Kaya nga, Labis-labis ang kanyang kagalakan. Nagmamadali siyang bumisita sa kanyang pinsang nangangailangan ng tulong. Bakit? Sapagkat alam niya marami siyang maaaring ibahagi sa kanyang kapwa. Alam niyo po, naniniwala ako sa kasabihan, You cannot give what you do not have. Hindi ka makapagbibigay ng kapayapaan sa iyong kapwa kung hindi mo taglay ang kapayapaan. Hindi ka makapagbibigay o makapagsisilbi sa iyong kapwa kapag hindi ka nakatanggap ng kabutihan sa iyo ding kapwa. Hindi ka makapagbibigay ng pag-ibig sa iyong kapwa kung hindi ka unang inibi. At tayong lahat ay tumanggap ng pag-ibig sa Diyos tumanggap ng awa ng Diyos kahit pa nga hindi tayo karapat dapat. Kaya nga, ang bawat isa sa atin tulad ni Maria pinagpala. Pinagpala sa iba't ibang degree, sa iba't ibang level. Pero ang mahalaga doon, taglay natin ang pagpapala ng Diyos. Taglay natin ang presensya ng Diyos sa ating buhay. At ang presensya na yun ng Diyos ay sapat para tayo ay magalak, sapat din mga kapatid para tayo ay maglingkod at gumawa ng mabuti sa ating kapwa. Tingnan natin si Inang Maria. Dahil siya'y puspos ng biyaya ng Diyos, nagmamadali na pumunta, humahangos, na pumunta sa kanyang pinsang si Elizabeth para paglingkuran ito at tuwangan sapagkat ito'y buntis. Alam natin ang kwento ni Elizabeth. Siya ay may katandaan na at baog sa kanyang kalagayan, tunay na kinakailangan niya ng katuwang. At naroroon si Maria, bagamat maselan din ang kanyang kalagayan, nagmamadali upang magbigay ng panahon, magsilbi sa kanyang pinsan, magpakita ng pagmamahal at kabutihan. Kapag ang tao, batid niya na siya'y pinagpala, may mga bagay na hindi niya mapigilan sa kanyang sarili. Yung grasya ng Diyos gives us a very happy disposition that you simply cannot contain. Kaya nga, di ba kapag tayo puspos ng biyaya ng Diyos, palagi tayong nakangiti. Tingnan nyo nga yung mga katabi nyo kung nakangiti. Siyempre, hindi niya makikita kasi naka-face mask. 
Pero nakikita yan sa disposisyon. Nakikita yan sa pagsasalita, sa pakikitungo natin sa tao, sa kabutihan na ibinabahagi natin sa kanila. You can't help but to be joyful because you are filled with the presence of God, with the grace of God. Maraming bagay ang ginagawa ng pagpapala ng Diyos sa ating buhay. You can't help but to share. Kapag puspos ang biyaya ng Diyos, ang tao, ang, ang taong mabuti, ang kasyanong mabuti, hindi madamot. Palagi ang handa na magbahagi anuman. Kahit na ito'y kakarampot lamang ang biyayang tinatanggap niya sa Diyos. Sapagkat alam niya, ang biyayang yon ay galing sa Diyos na nagtuturo sa atin na maging mabuti rin sa ating kapwa tulad ng kabutihan ng Diyos sa ating lahat bagamat tayo ay hindi karapat dapat. Walang ibang hinangad ang Diyos na suplian natin ang Kanyang pagpapala sapagkat hindi natin mapapantayan ang pagpapala ng Diyos. Hindi rin natin masusuplian ang Kanyang kabutihan. Ang nais niya, maging mabuti rin tayo sa ating kapwa. Yung biyayang tinanggap natin, ibahagi natin sa abot ng ating kakayanan. Ang pagpapala ng Diyos, nag-uudyok sa tao na maglingkod. Hindi lamang magbahagi. Magbahagi ng oras, magbahagi ng material na bagay, kundi maglingkod. Maraming pagkakataon na tayo'y tinatawag sa paglilingkod. Huwag na tayong lumayo pa sa ating mga tahanan. Paano natin pinaglilingkuran ang ating mga kapamilya, ating magulang na, may ma na matatanda na at mahihina na? Paano natin sila pinaglilingkuran at pinapakitaan ng kabutihan? Ang inyong mga anak sa mga magulang na naririto at ang mga anak sa kanilang mga magulang ang ating kapwa na nakapaligid sa atin, sa ating trabaho, sa ating pamayanan, papano tayo naglilingkod sa bawat isa sapagkat hindi magiging kumpleto ang ating pagiging kristyano kung hindi tayo marunong maglingkod ng may pagmamahal at ng may kabutihan. Ang mag sa atin yan, biyaya ng Diyos. If we realize how good God is despite our unworthiness, then it should move us to share and to serve our fellow men. Hindi lang natatapos doon. Kapag puspus ka ng biyaya ng Diyos, you can't help but to proclaim. Katulad ni Maria, puspus ng biyaya ng Diyos. Kaya nga, sa kaibuturan ng kanyang puso, ipinahayag niya sa isang awit. Sabi niya, My soul proclaims the greatness of the Lord. My spirit rejoices in God, my Savior, not because I am worthy, but because God is merciful. And I think tayong lahat, pwede rin nating awitin yun ng buo nating pagkatao at kaluluwa. Puspus tayo ng biyaya ng Diyos. Nagpapasalamat tayo. Tumanggap tayo ng biyaya. Hindi dahil tayo karapat dapat, kundi dahil sa awa ng Diyos. Kaya nga, ang paalala sa atin ng Ibanghelyo, tumanggap tayo ng awa. Magbigay din tayo ng awa sa, sa ating kapwa. Tumanggap tayo ng pagpapatawad sa Diyos, magpatawad din tayo sa ating kapwa. Pinaglingkuran tayo ng Panginoon sa pamamagitan ng Kanyang buhay dito sa lupa. Matuto tayo sa Kanyang halimbawa. Tumanggap tayo ng kabutihan ng Diyos. Ipahayag natin yan, hindi lamang sa salita, kundi sa gawa. Magiging makabuluhan, mga kapatid, ang ating pagdidibusyon kay mahal na ina kung ating pipiliting sundin at sundan ang halimbawa na kanilang ipinamalas sa atin. Hindi lamang tayo magdadasal, 
tayo rin ay gagawa ng kabutihan. At sa pamamagitan ng paglilingkod natin sa isa't isa, ipapahayag natin ang kabutihan at awa ng Diyos. Amen. Please stand. My brothers and sisters, let us glorify our Savior who chose the Virgin Mary for His mother. Now for every prayer we shall say, May your mother intercede for us, Lord. May your mother intercede for us, Lord. Eternal Word, make your church of one mind and one heart in love and help all those who believe to be one in prayer with Mary. Mother of unity, we pray. May your mother intercede for us, Lord. You made Mary full of grace. Grant to all men and women who have been called to serve your people the joyful abundance of your grace, that they may become living witnesses of your peace and justice in their vocation of wholehearted service, we pray. May your mother intercede for us, Lord. You made Mary the mother of mercy. May all who are faced with trials feel her motherly love and care, we pray. May your mother intercede for us, Lord. Mary, receive God's word with an open heart. May we free ourselves from useless anxieties and learn to entrust our life under God's loving protection, we pray. May your mother intercede for us, Lord. For all of us gathered here, may the example of our blessed mother continually inspire and guide us in our obligation to protect lives, we pray. May your mother intercede for us, Lord. For our personal intentions and for the intentions of the de devotees of Our Lady of the Rosary of Manawag, we pray. May your mother intercede for us, Lord. Lord God, give to your people the joy of continual health in mind and body with the prayers of the Virgin Mary to help us, guide us through the sorrows of this life to eternal happiness in the life to come. This we pray through Christ our Lord. Amen. Please be seated.
Pray, my brothers and sisters, that my sacrifice and yours may be acceptable to God, the Almighty Father. May the Lord accept the sacrifice at your hands for the praise and glory of His name, for our good and the good of all His Holy Church. Lord God, may your gifts be sanctified by the Holy Spirit, who formed the Blessed Virgin Mary to be a new creation and bathe her with the dew of heavenly grace, so that she might bear the fruit of salvation. Through Christ our Lord. Amen. The Lord be with you. And with your spirit. Lift up your hearts. We lift them up to the Lord. Let us give thanks to the Lord our God. It is right and just. It is truly right and just, our duty and our salvation, always and everywhere to give you thanks. Lord, Holy Father, Almighty and Eternal God, through Christ our Lord. For by your Holy Spirit, you inspired Elizabeth to reveal the surpassing honor you have given to the Blessed Virgin Mary. Mary is rightly hailed as blessed because she believed in your promise of salvation. In her act of loving service, she greeted as mother of the Lord by the mother of Christ, Herald. We make our own canticle of joy in the lips of God's virgin mother, and in our lowliness, we to proclaim your greatness in the never-ending hymn of the whole company of angels and saints as they cry out. You are indeed holy, O Lord, the fount of all holiness. Make holy, therefore, this gifts we pray, by sending down your Spirit upon them like the dewfall, so that they may become for us the body and blood of our Lord Jesus Christ. At the time he was betrayed and entered willingly into his passion, he took bread and, giving thanks, broke it gave it to his disciples, saying, Take this, all of you, and eat of it, for this is my body, which will be given up for you. In a similar way, when supper was ended, he took the chalice, once more giving thanks. He gave it to his disciples, saying, Take this, all of you, and drink from it, for this is the chalice of my blood, the blood of the new and eternal covenant, which will be poured out for you and for many for the forgiveness of sins. Do this in memory of me. The mystery of faith. We proclaim your death, O Lord.
Therefore, as we celebrate the memorial of his death and resurrection, we offer you, Lord, the bread of life and the chalice of salvation, giving thanks that you have held us worthy to be in your presence and minister to you. Humbly we pray that partaking of the body and blood of Christ, we may be gathered into one by the Holy Spirit. Remember, Lord, your church has spread throughout the world and bring her to the fullness of charity, together with Francis our Pope, Socrates our Bishop, and all the clergy. Remember also our brothers and sisters who have fallen asleep in the hope of the resurrection and all who have died in your mercy. Welcome them into the light of your face. Have mercy on us all, we pray, that with the Blessed Virgin Mary, Mother of God, with Blessed Joseph, her most chaste spouse, with the Blessed Apostles and all the saints who have pleased you throughout the ages, we may merit to be co-heirs to eternal life and may praise and glorify you to your Son, Jesus Christ. Through Him, with Him, in Him, in the unity of the Holy Spirit, all glory and honor is yours, Almighty Father, forever and ever. Please stand. At the Savior's command and formed by divine teaching, we dare to pray. Deliver us, Lord, we pray, from every evil. Graciously grant peace in our days, that by the help of your mercy, we may be always free from sin and safe from all distress as we await the blessed hope and the coming of our Savior, Jesus Christ. For the kingdom, the... Lord Jesus Christ, who said to your apostles, Peace I leave you, my peace I give you. Look not on our sins, but on the faith of your church, 
and graciously grant our peace and unity in accordance with your will, who live and reign forever and ever. Amen. The peace of the Lord be with you always. And with your spirit. My brothers and sisters, let us give one another the sign of Christ's peace. Peace be with you. Behold, this is Jesus Christ, the Son of Mary, the Lamb of God who takes away the sins of the world. Happy are those who are called to receive Him. Lord, I am not worthy that you should enter under my roof, but only say the word, and my soul shall be healed. May the body and blood of Christ bring us to everlasting life. Amen.
Please kneel. Prayer for the elections. Let us pray that the forthcoming elections may truly reflect the will of the Lord who guides the destinies of nations. Let us pray together. Deliver us, Lord. Deliver us, Lord, from coercion, violence, and terrorism. Deliver us, Lord, from dishonesty, lies, and all distortion of truth. Deliver us, Lord, from bribery, graft, and all conspiracy for fraud. Deliver us, Lord, from threats, intimidation, and perverse language. Deliver us, Lord. Let us pray together. Hear us, Lord. Hear us, Lord, that conscience may always be our ultimate norm. Hear us, Lord, that the common good may always be our highest goal. Hear us, Lord, that human dignity may be respected all the time. Hear us, Lord, that the poor and the weak may always have the priority. Hear us, Lord, the genuine fear of God and love of neighbors may guide those who seek public office. Hear us, Lord. Let us pray. Savior of the nations, politics is your gift to us, a call to serve others. May our political engagement for voters and candidates bring glory to your loving name and help us grow in holiness forever and ever. Amen. Please stand. Let us pray. Lord our God, you have nourished the church with your sacramental gifts and pour out on it the Holy Spirit. May it hasten to bring your message of joy to the whole world so that all peoples who receive your saving word may rejoice in your redeeming love and acknowledge Christ as their Savior who lives and reigns forever and ever. Amen. Please be seated. The Minor Basilica of Our Lady of the Rosary of Manawag would like to thank Reverend Father Christopher Jeffrey Aitona Opi for presiding over the Novena Mass. We would like also to thank the Word Proclaimers, Eucharistic Ministers, Knights of the Altar, the Colores Choir, Catechists, Collectoras, and Church Greeters for actively participating in the Eucharistic celebration and being one in honoring the Blessed Mother. And finally, we thank you, our dear pilgrims and sponsors of this Mass. May the care and the intercession of the Blessed Mother, Our Lady of the Rosary of Manawag, bring us closer to her Son, Jesus Christ. Please stand. The Lord be with you. And with your spirit. Bow your heads for the blessing. May God, through the childbearing of the Blessed Virgin Mary, willed in His great kindness to redeem the human race, be pleased to enrich you with His blessing. Amen. Amen. May you know always and everywhere the protection of her through whom you have been found worthy to receive the author of life. Amen. May you who have devoutly gathered on this day carry away with you the gifts of spiritual joys and heavenly reward. Amen. And may the blessing of Almighty God, the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit come down on you and remain with you forever. Amen. Our Mass ascended. We go in the love and peace of Christ. Thanks be to God. Let us have the prayer for the blessing of the sick. <clears throat> Bow your head for the blessing. God Almighty Father, by your blessing, you give us strength and support in our frailty. Turn with kindness toward our sick brothers and sisters. Free them from all illness and restore them to good health through the intercession of Our Lady of the Rosary of Manawag, so that in the sure knowledge of your goodness, they will greatly bless your holy name. We ask this through Christ our Lord. Amen. 
prayer for the blessing of rosaries and other religious articles. Let us pray. In memory of the mysteries of the life, death, and resurrection of our Lord Jesus Christ, and to the honor and glory of the Blessed Virgin Mary, Mother of Christ, Mother of the Church, Our Lady of the Rosary of Manawag, may these rosaries, images, candles, oil, and other religious articles be blessed and made holy. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Amen. Write the blessing of the vehicle carrying the image of Our Lady. Our help is in the name of the Lord. The Lord be with you. Let us pray. Almighty and merciful God, creator and preserver of the human race, giver of heavenly grace, and lavish dispenser of eternal salvation, we humbly beg you in your immeasurable goodness to bless this vehicle carrying the image of Our Lady of the Rosary in honor and praise of the mother of your son as it embarks today on its journey within the Archdiocese of Lingayen, Dagupan. With your holy benediction, bless the places in which this vehicle will traverse that the, the, the residents may be preserved from the pandemic caused by the enemies, visible and invisible. Likewise, may all the faithful who venerate the image while meditating on the divine mysteries receive abundant grace, be delivered and be cured from all forms of illness and suffering of body and spirit. These we ask in the name of our Lord Jesus Christ, who lives and reigns with you in unity of the Holy Spirit, 
one God, forever and ever. Amen. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. The Lord be with you and with your spirit. May the Almighty God bless you in the name of the Father and of the Son and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Go in peace. Thanks be to God.